What's in the fucking box? You motherfuckers trying to box with God. The God Box Podcast. <sighs> and we back. And we back so soon. This is very soon for me to do a um a God Box episode, man. This is crazy. Alright, so uh, hit the thumbs up and that like button. Subscribe for me. Um I'm your boy the finesse guy. Like I'm I'm throwed off. Like today I I am perplexed. I am throwed. Like what the actual like what the what the actual hell is going on in the world um i don't know what i titled this hopefully youtube ain't clap me for the title bro but like today man on the god box bro i know i usually do a speech a little intro all that good shit man this shit my opinions and we just here to have fun and laugh so this episode of the god box we talking about not a sipping paint, but a sucking paint. <laughs> we talking about a sucking paint. We talking about a motherfucking suck and paint, nigga. I know some of y'all might be like, nigga, who the hell are you talking about a sucking paint? Bro, go on Twitter, type in sipping paint. Look at the video. It's like an all red video. And it's crazy. It goes crazy. So that shit's crazy. So basically, if you have seen the video, you don't know what I'm talking about. You don't want to go on Twitter. You don't own the Twitter. You ain't trying to do that shit. Be like, nigga, just tell me. So apparently, it was a female at a sipping paint, bro. And from what I gathered, the story that I gathered uh, was that they was painting like like male models like new male models like most art shit like it'll be like you paint like a new model or something like you'll like draw it painting i ain't never really heard of nobody painting a new model because painting takes a little longer than drawing actually but i mean it's, it's a possibility i'm not ruling it out so needless to say they paint the model and i don't know if the wine kicked in too heavy i don't know I don't know. I don't know. Like, there's no more details. Like, all we know is showed you that it's simple paint. The model was naked. Next thing you know, she got got three thousand in the middle of the flow. Like, when I tell you, bro, the middle of the fucking floor, the middle of the fuck. Like, I'm talking about like the rows. Like, if you ever been to a simple paint, you know it's like rows and tables and all that shit. And like this little aisles you gotta go through. Like, as an instructor, just me personally. I've done, I've taught a sipping paint or two. So you got to go through these aisles to make sure everybody on the same page. Everybody following along. They doing what they supposed to and everything like that, right? I don't know what happened, but like, it was like the paintings right here. She turned and was like, meet, meet, meet. Like that shit is insane. Nigga. So my first reaction when I first heard it, I thought niggas was bullshitting. Like I thought, like, like dog. Like I, I said, I legitimately thought, like, oh, they got busted at the sipping paint in like the bathroom or something. Like it was in a corner. She's getting a nigga hand in a corner or some shit. No, nigga, you watch that video. It's out in the open, right next to people. She's got her dick right next to niggas, bro. What? In a whole panorama. In a whole panorama giving throat. She making OnlyFans content at the sip and paint. That shit is beyond me. Like, when I seen that, I was like, there is no way. First of all, if you watch the, like, the straight video, and I'm not finna put that video on here because YouTube gonna clap the fuck out of me. Um... I'm I'm reckless, but I ain't that damn reckless, bro. Like nigga, first of all, that nigga had her neck bent like that nigga, like her shit was like this. And like it was further than that. It's like her shit was parallel to her shoulder, nigga. Like 
bro she was giving that giraffe throat nigga cuz bro what the fuck like as an artist myself right i've i've drawn i painted some wild shit i got a whole twitter called r after dark finesse fgm art after dark to where it ain't nothing but sex like i'm talking about like i draw everything i it was like a few years like a year or two ago I, i've since like stopped doing it because i get tired of doing the shit but like people really like this shit so i, I did it for a long time um and like i still do my own art after dark all that shit i painted a few pictures canvases whatever but nigga never have i been around acrylic paint and been like damn it's something about this cerulean blue that makes me want to get some head it ain't never crossed my mind to be like where the hell savage beauty at? i need to suck a titty like it ain't never gave that it has never gave me that emotion to where I feel like I need sex now. I get it's wine involved. I get it. Wine make you feel sexy as fuck. Everybody know that shit. Everybody know it. But my guy, my boy, to legit open your throat to source Rex, to a nigga you don't know. And give him head in the middle of the aisle where other patrons is around to where these niggas really don't know you in the whole pandemic is crazy like slim like who does that who who did that? Who said that? Like, nigga. Who? Like. Like, I still don't believe that shit happened. Like. I just hope she's single. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Like, your girl going to the sipping paint. And now she viral for sucking a nigga's meat. For having his meat down her throat. Because it was down her throat. He was, that nigga was dog in her mouth. Nigga. That nigga was going ham. Shit. That nigga was going like forcefully. Nah. Like y'all niggas know. Shit. Y'all been on Pornhub. Hell. But bro like she can't say she was drunk. Nigga, at Peyton Sips, they don't let you get that fucked up. Like, you might get one or two glasses of wine, but they tell you sip that bitch. Like, they not letting you get fucked up. Unless she bought her own shit or she, like, she pre game before the Peyton Sip. pre game and a Peyton Sip is crazy. But, like, nigga, are you dead ass right now? How? Like, like, why? Why would you why would you do that? Like Like the backstory, the only thing I could think of, right? Is she just got out of some shit. <laughs> like she just got out of a bad relationship. A nigga broke her heart. Something it gotta be something along those lines, cause that's the only time females wild out like that. Only time. Like nigga, like Bro, it's gotta be. And she went out with the girls and was like, Yo, girl, fuck that nigga. Let's go ahead. We can go to this painting set. I heard they supposed to have like new models. And girl, we gonna have fun. We gonna sip some wine. Girl, you gonna forget him. We gonna have fun. We finna be lit all week, bitch. It's your week, bitch. <laughs> like, you know how females get with this shit. It's your week, bitch. You finna live. Fuck that nigga. Like on Insecure, bitch, you Issa Rae, bitch. You gonna find you a nigga. Nigga, we Molly. 
Nigga, I'm Molly, you Issa Rae, she's Kelly. Like, nigga. Like, y'all know how females get. And females, you lying if you say you don't get like that when your girl break up with a nigga or a nigga break her heart. So, uh, I cut the cat. So, that's the only that's the only thing in, in, in my right mind that I can be like, yo, she was just going through a lot. The wine hit her extremely hard. She ain't drink. She she used to be like alcoholic anonymous, and like when she met him, they things was going good. She hadn't drank the whole relationship, like, and then when he left, she said fuck it, on like some euphoria jewels and rue shit. Like fuck it, I'm finna just fucking drink again, and she been drinking nonstop all week, and they just wanted to get her out the house because she been depressed, and she went to the paint and sip, and that nigga was just standing there, and he was saying all the right shit. He was risen her ass up, in the words of Casanet and Duke Dennis. Hit her with the Riz. That's game for some of y'all that might not know. Um, Rizzed her ass up real quick, and she she couldn't handle it. She seen his meat. Meat was out. It was already there. It was prepared and cooked. It was out. So she said, I'm going to go ahead and dibble and dabble in this. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna dabble in these delicacies. I'm gonna dabble in this dick. That's what I'm like, nigga. Like, I don't understand. Oh. And the other, other question I got, I got two questions. Do you continue painting? What three? Do you continue painting after that? Like you like two tables down, but not even two two chairs down, and it's just like you painting and shit. I know I don't see what the fuck I think I see. Is she sucking his dick? Is his whole dick in her mouth? Oh my god, god, look at that shit! And like you seeing him in the background, like I, I paid attention to the video because I knew I was gonna do this podcast, so I paid attention to the video. You see a homegirl in the background. The whole time she, he, she sucking his dick. His dick is down. Oh, it's down her throat, girl. Like this, that's all you seen. She talking to her home girl, like, oh my god, I can't believe. Oh, I am a Christian woman. I came out here for a nice time. <laughs> like just imagine how many motherfuckers you just scarred. They never go into a paint sip again. Nigga. And the other question that I want to ask, what the fuck is security? What the fuck were they doing? Like, nigga, where the fuck was the, the instructor? Like, security was like, la, la, la. oh, shit. Yo, we, we gonna need somebody down here. We got a lady sucking a dick. Like, nigga, what? <laughs> like, and at that point, do you break that shit up? Like, that's... <sighs> you can't say it's public indecent. Indecency, like, the charge you get. Like, if you get caught having sex or some shit. Like, he can't really register as a sex offender because he got paid to do that. Like, I'm, he was a model there. Like, at first I heard it was, like, stripper or something. But it was, like, he was, like, one of the models there. And he got paid to basically show off his body. And so, like, I don't know. Like, what would that charge be? Like, could you charge somebody for that? Because it's not like she didn't want it to happen. Because she was allowing her throat to get stuffed. But, like, my guy. Like, what? Like, can you even get charged? That is it. That is sick. And then the last question I have. Where the fuck was her friends? Because if it was the bitches that were sitting at their table, they are not her friends. <laughs> Shorty, you need new friends. Your girls let you go viral. Because no damn well somebody was going to record that shit. Nigga, 
So do you need new friends? Cause like you need new friends, nigga. Cause like who let their homegirl just suck a random nigga dick? Y'all don't even let niggas dance in the club with your girls. You gonna let her put her mouth on a raw penis? And she don't know this nigga? Throat goat. These are not your friends. <laughs> How do you continue paying after that? Do you continue paying? Is the event canceled? Like, like, do you just stop? Like, is it like, yo, we just gonna offer refunds because this is crazy? Like, if you if you the host or you threw that event, you planned that if you the event plan, what is this a bad look on your reputation? Or is this good? Like, man, my paint sip was so fire, I got the nigga dick sucked that night, nigga. Y'all need, boy, I'm telling you. Asking me if I can throw five vets, nigga. I got motherfuckers giving head in the open. Bro. <laughs> I, I can't. I, I still can't believe that shit happened, bro. And like, I have so many questions. Like, what's the backstory? What the fuck was going on? To where, like, she turned the sipping paint to a sucking paint. Ain't even the sucking paint. Sucking paint that throat. Like, nigga. He was monging her shit. Nigga. Mong, mong, mong. Like, nigga. <laughs> the sound effects is crazy. But, bruh. I wasn't even supposed to do another God Box episode yet. But, bruh. Shorty Wally. That nigga said, I ain't had in a long time. Like, only thing I could think, bruh. Is she got her heart broke. Or she was just out ha- trying to have fun, forget about some shit. Like, that's the only reasonable backstory for something that drastic. To where your girls is going to let you keep doing it. Nigga. A whole penis. And I, I can see some people be like, well, what if she knew the nigga? Fuck him later. <laughs> nigga, this, this wine got me lit. You trying to get out of here? Fuck that nigga in the car. Fuck him in the bathroom. You want to be freaky. But nigga not in the middle of the paint and sip. Nigga you got couples out here probably just trying to have a good time. This shit low key orgy. Because it's like 20 some people. Boy that shit crazy bro. I don't even know what to say. Like what are you... Like, how do you top that? If you do paint sips, you can't top that. Like, that nigga, whoever threw that paint sip about to be the go-to paint sip person. But it was like, yo, whatever you did last time, do that shit for mine so we can go viral. Because I know niggas really, really think like that. Like, yo, plan my shit so we can go viral. But so, my business can start booming. Bro, that shit is insane. Shorty really just my man shit like shit all my years of paint and I've been painting since like 2015 so I say I've been painting for seven years I've been drawing since I was five so I've been shit like 25 years I've been in this art game I ain't never got turned on by none of the shit I did like I ain't I ain't never painted a new model I wouldn't want to but like I don't know I don't, this gen, yeah, bro, this generation built different these niggas bro Whew. at one point in time you didn't females didn't even want niggas knowing they suck dick it was oh, I don't suck dick no, I don't suck. Ooh, this dirt. Ooh, ooh, ooh this dirty. Ooh, who's up? Ooh, I ain't no hoe. Now they just be like swallow, goggle, goggle. They be proud. Oh, hey man, get it how you live. If that's what you want to do. Do it. 
I know my niggas ain't turning this shit. <laughs> I know my niggas is not complaining at all. Huh. Yeah, man. Ah, uh, this is another episode of the God Box, man. Cause that is insane. Like this whole God Box. It was supposed to be another episode, but once that story dropped, fuck that other one, bro. It 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 don't even feel right talking about anything else. So hey, man, just uh, make sure you hit that thumbs up, that like button for me. Subscribe. Join the God Squad. Um. Shout out to Finesse God Masterpieces, my art page, since we on it. That's why I threw this little Basquiat photo up. And then it's a nice little Deodora hoodie and whatever. But that's crazy. That is insane. They sucking dicks at the sipping paints now, bro. I'm glad I did not take that job as an instructor, boy. If I had to worry about getting my dicks up. <laughs> I gotta worry about getting my meat up. Not if I ran out of paint. Not if I can do the time limit. If a girl gonna try to suck my meat. Because I'm up here painting. Lord have mercy. Where are we going to hell? <laughs> Earth is going to hell. <laughs> We're in the burn. <laughs> I gotta get out of here. I love y'all. Thank y'all for watching, man. I'm the finesse guy, eighty eight J Diggy ninety two. It's another episode of the God Box Podcast, man. Fellas, protect your meat because <laughs> they out here. <laughs> they just using us now. Ah. Huh. <coughs> uh. Oh shit. I love y'all, man. <laughs> I <laughs> That's the fucking pay and sip, bro. What the fuck?